Hello everybody, welcome to my channel. In this video, I will be showing how to solve the integral of x over 1 plus x cubed as we see here in the upper left hand corner. At first glance, this seems that we can do this by u substitution, but u substitution would require x squared in the numerator whereas in this problem we have only x. This means that it requires a little bit more effort on our part, but nonetheless it can be done. The first thing I notice is that the, new, the denominator is a sum of two cubes. If I have a cubed plus b cubed, I can rewrite this as a plus b times the quantity a squared plus AB plus B squared. Therefore, I will attempt a partial fraction decomposition and I will rewrite X over 1 plus X cubed as A over 1 plus X plus BX plus C over 1 minus X plus X squared. I can use the heavy side method and cover up the 1 plus x on the left hand side while substituting x equals negative 1. This will allow me to quickly compute the value of a and when I do this I find that a is equal to negative 1 third. The next steps are to find b and c. So I will write x equals negative one-third, one minus x plus x squared plus bx plus c times one plus x. When I multiply this out, I can now gather the like terms. If I gather all the like terms in x squared, I will find that negative one-third plus b equals zero. Likewise, when I gather all the constant terms, I find that negative one-third plus c is equal to zero. This gives me that b is equal to c is equal to one-third. I can now insert these values in place of b and c. Since all the numerators have a one-third in them, I can factor out a one-third and pull it to the outside of the parentheses. And I can also reverse the order of the fractions. I can now insert this into my integral to get a rewritten integral that is somewhat easier to solve. The next step is to look at the first fraction, x plus 1 over 1 minus x plus x squared. I can attempt to do this by u substitution. If I did this, u would equal 1 minus x plus x squared and du would equal 2x minus 1. However, I can write x plus 1 is equal to 1 half times 2x minus 1 plus 3 halves. If I substitute this into the original fraction, I can then split up the fraction, factor out a 1 half, and write the fraction as this, 1 half times 2x minus 1 over 1 minus x plus x squared plus 3 over 1 minus x plus x squared. We now have an integral that has three terms. Using the property that integrals are linear, that is, if I have the integral of a sum, I can take the integral of each individual element of that sum. I can split this up into three integrals, which I will then solve individually. The first integral will be solved by u substitution. The second will be solved by completing the square. And the third integral is simple enough that I can solve it directly. And that is going to be the natural log of 1 plus x. Now let's direct our attention to the first integral. 
As I said, we will solve this by u substitution. As we did before, we will allow u to equal 1 minus x plus x squared. And we will allow du to equal 2x minus 1. This means that the integral is equal to 1 half times the integral of 1 over u du, which is simply 1 half times the natural log of u. Since u was equal to 1 minus x plus x squared, I have to substitute this in place of u, and I will get that, one half, that the integral is 1 half times the natural log of 1 minus x plus x squared. And now I can substitute this expression in place of the first integral. Let's now focus our attention on the second integral. We said that we would solve this by completing the square. And therefore, we will rewrite our integral as 3 halves times 1 over x minus 1 half squared plus 3 fourths. In this form, I can use the rule that the integral of 1 over a squared plus u squared is equal to 1 over a times the inverse tangent of u over a. If I allow u to equal x minus 1 half, this means that du will be dx and a will be equal to the square root of 3 over 2. In this form, my integral then becomes 3 over 2 times 2 times the square root of 3 times the inverse tangent of 2u over 3. The 2s will cancel out and simply leave me with the square root of 3 times the inverse tangent of 2u over the square root of 3. I still need to substitute back in for x, and if I remember that u is equal to x minus 1 half, I obtain the square root of 3 times the inverse tangent of 2x minus 1 over the square root of 3. I can now insert this into the place of the second integral, and I can distribute the one-third among the parentheses. This gives me a final answer of 1 over 6 times natural log 1 minus x plus x squared plus square root of 3 over 3 times the inverse tangent of 2x minus 1 over the square root of 3 minus 1 third times the natural log of 1 plus x plus, of course, the constant of integration c. This is the final answer. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, please consider giving it a thumbs up and subscribe to see more videos in the future. Thank you very much.